uh, interesting and great about working with participant is from the beginning, they're thinking about the uh, when the film comes out, everything that comes from from it. So all the social action uh, opportunities of the filmmaking. That said, it's not that that will dictate how you make the film. They're thinking of how do we use the film as a launching pad for uh, action that actually can be taken to help address the issues raised by the film. So it's kind of a parallel thing that's happening. Um, we were allowed a lot of <clears throat> independence in making Last Call and also with making Misconception. In other words, we didn't have someone hanging over our shoulder saying, what are you going to film next? You know, We were really able to, to focus on the storytelling. Um, and then knowing that there's this team ready to pick up the ball and to say, OK, you know, now we have the film. How do we engage different groups, different people to keep the conversation going? And I love the idea that a film is kind of the entry point for different discussions, um, different, uh, even uh, different, uh, what they call, you know, shoulder content, you know, shorter pieces that, again, can reach and engage audiences in, the, in different ways. So, like with Last Call at the Oasis, there was the change the course campaign to try to restore water to the Colorado River. I've met people who knew about that cam campaign first and then came to watch the film, and of course vice versa, and that is a really interesting way to uh, you know, integrate the creative side of things and the activist side of things, I guess you could say.